nuclear friction on the 96 well shuttle. The first step is to power up the nuclear effector and the 96 well shuttle and to start the 96 well shuttle software. The software remotely controls the nuclear effector 2 and switches it to 96 well mode. 96 well nuclear effector kits contain the 96 well nuclear cuvette plate, a cell specific solution, plus a special supplement. The supplement has to be added to 96 well nuclear effector solution. Comprehensive information about the whole nuclear effection process, including volumes, cell numbers, and cell culture conditions, can be found in the corresponding cell specific optimized protocols. Prior to the transfection, a 96 well culture plate with medium is prepared for the post nuclear infection cell culture. The plate is then placed in a cell culture incubator to equilibrate with respect to temperature and CO2. The cells required for all samples are prepared according to the optimized protocol. Possible void volumes should be taken into consideration. After the centrifugation, the cell culture medium has to be removed as carefully and completely as possible. The cell pellet then has to be gently resuspended in the supplemented 96 well nuclear effector solution. Now the substrate, be it RNA or DNA, has to be transferred to the nucleocuvette plate. The nucleocuvette plate is removed from the sterile blister package and the substrates are transferred to the 96 well nucleocuvette plate. Make sure that the substrate has been properly added to the bottom of the nucleocuvette plate. Then add the cell suspension to the substrates. Adding the cell suspension to the substrate ensures sufficient mixing of substrates and cells. Cover the plate with the lid, remove potentially residing air bubbles by gently tapping the plate, and insert it into the retainer of the 96 well shuttle. Nuclear infection is started by clicking Upload and Start in the software. Each well is now individually processed. Processing the whole plate will take between 3 to 5 minutes, depending on the applied 96 well programs. The nuclear infection process transfers the substrate into the cytosol and the nucleus of the cells, enabling the transfection of resting and non-dividing cells. Progress and transfection results are shown on the shuttle display and filed in the 96 well shuttle software. When the last well has been processed, the retainer opens automatically and the 96 well nucleocuvette plate can be removed. After the nuclear infection process, Free warmed culture medium is added to the cells in the 96 well nucleocuvette plate. The cells are then transferred to the previously prepared 96 well cell culture plate and placed in an incubator. 
Depending on the cell type and substrate, the transfection results can often be measured as early as four hours following nucleofection.